hey it's Marcus Exum and here right now I'm going to start off the video by showing you the stats of the cloak that I'm going to test right now which is the ghastly trait compared to the ghostly concealment and basically looks pretty cool invisible for 5.5 seconds this is also invisible for 5.5 seconds so basically the same uh, amount of visibility um, but then the difference is ghastly drape gets two seconds of speedy which is really really cool and this does not but this gives five speed two vitality two wisdom four dexterity while the ghastly drape only gives nothing um, 4% fame bonus for both and this costs 110 MP while this costs maybe 85 so right now my impression is that you can use this more and since I don't have a great pet probably need to use this more but this is better for rushing and might be cooler especially if with the set but I'm going to go test it out right now and I'll s show you what I think about it later Alright, so this is me just putting it on for the first time before. So yeah, I'm just testing out the sets to look nice. And so, first off, you can see I am running around the Godlands. The rest of the gameplay is probably that. And maybe running in a UDL and failing because of lag. So of course, the nice thing about the Ghastly Drape is it has the same amount of time as the T6 load. Um, but what I found was kind of sketchy was about it was um, running around the Godlands and if I saw like a beholder, if you see right there, and a ghost god, which could like potentially one hit me, if you uh, see right there, uh, I almost ran into the gods because of the speedy and if this the god was still shooting I might have died because of the huge amount of gods there or if it was a ghost god and it's hard to control your character when you're going very speedy if you play warrior a lot you might be able to tell that sometimes the speedy kills you so that's something I found uh, from just playing around with it so yeah um, what I found from the stats however is if you have a good MP pet, um, I'd actually say Ghastly Drape is probably better because, well, I mean, in my opinion, because of the um, speedy times two, uh, opposed to the ghostly cloak with the five speed and the extra dex, whiz, and def. I mean, uh, whiz and vit. It would give you it will give you an extra bonus all the time so it's not as noticeable as the, the automatic speedy when you use the cloak but it is really nice to use if you don't have a lot of uh, MP or you prefer not um, not to use the cloak all the time and here I'm trying to rush an abyss and I almost died because I think maybe it was lag Oh no no no, I got scared because of the speedy and I ran into uh, a huge brute and I just nexus uh, So yeah, speed kills, uh, especially on the road and in the ro uh, realm. Uh, yeah, so also when you're in a UDL, when you can't see a lot of the pro projectiles and the, the little traps on the ground, like in this case, I probably fail here. Um, so if you're going really fast and you're probably going to get some black tile lag you probably won't be able to see the little traps and when you uncloak on top of a trap you know, I think I do that yeah here if you do that right on top of the one that explodes in all directions you could potentially die uh, as an 88 rogue if you're already a little low on HP and I think I fail because I missed the boss so yeah those are some pros and cons in general I think I actually prefer the T6 cloak actually um, because 
it looks better with the set. That's really my only reason. And also UDLs are sketch with the uh, ghastly drape because of the speed. Um, if you see, I, I start to slow down because I don't want to get hit by the traps. While well, if I was using my normal cloak, I would be able to spot them immediately. So the only good thing about the ghastly drape... Oh, I accidentally like cloaked afterwards. I don't know how that happened. Anyways, only thing good about the ghastly drape that I've found is if you're looking for a WC um, and you're trying to get to the orcs too when they open it faster than everybody else and get some damage in as a rogue since everybody's going to be behind you when you fight orcs too you better get there fast so you better rush and here is some gameplay of me rushing to the godlands because of the teleport restrictions as you can tell it's very very fast uh, compared to other classes and especially uh, compared to when you're using a plane or a T6 cloak. Fortunately I do not have a plane walker so yeah that's kinda sad because I can't show you the comparison. Thank you and goodbye.